All right, so we had a lot of fun this morning. We talked about the things that were most important. And hopefully now we're all on the exact same page, realizing it's not about in this life just having a really big paycheck. It's not about having a fancy car. And it's not about having all those extra things that we consider so important, okay? But having a job that provides you with the financial resources will enable you to help others. It will enable you to make the world better. So now's the presentation that most of you guys have probably came for today, but hopefully you learn from the other presentations. And this presentation is the college to career. Because I realize when you come to college, most students don't come to college because they have this desire for extra learning. Most students don't come to college because they just can't wait to take more classes. You come to college, so you can get a career. You come to college so you can get the stuff you need, typically a degree, to be able to get the job that you desire. So what's going to set you apart in the three, four, five, eight years if you're going on to be a doctor and those years of schooling, what's going to set you apart? And there's this quote that I really love, so I want you to pay attention, okay? The most important homework you ever get in college will never be assigned to you. The most important homework you ever get will never be assigned to you. And so you're sitting there thinking, and you're like, well, the most important homework is not going to be assigned. No, nobody's going to assign it to you because it's what you choose to do. You have the choice to put yourself above your fellow classmates. And today we're going to talk about those things that are important, those things that will put you in top. Yes, we're going to look at specific guidelines. What should you be doing your freshman and sophomore years? What should you be doing your junior and senior years? That's going to set you apart. We're going to look about what you should be doing in the classroom, what you should be doing at your school, what you should be doing outside of your school through networking, through internships, through cold calling. We're going to talk about all these type of things that is going to put you and that top 3% of college graduates, you're going to have a resume that looks good. Because here's the thing, everything you did in high school, it got you into the college you're here now. Everything you did in high school works for getting scholarships. But when you graduate college, absolutely nothing before college should be on your resume, which means guess what? We all as freshmen start with a blank sheet of paper. Now it's time to fill up this blank sheet of paper with things that we have done. So let's get excited, let's get ready. Let's be ready to learn what we should be doing now so when we graduate college, we can get a good job. And with that good job, we can transform the world through our influence and through the money that we receive. Because let's face it, guys, it's not about how much money I get for myself, but it can be about how much money can I share with those that are less fortunate. So there's a lot of really awesome things we can do here and a lot of great things. So we're going to start off with the world's largest resume uh, interview taking place right now. We're going to play the live resume game to see where you guys are at. But the good news is hopefully at the end of this, we all know where we should be going. So let's begin. 